Hello my beautiful butterflies and welcome back to my channel. Today's video I'm going to share with you a small Gucci unboxing. So if you want to see what that's all about you guys just keep right on watching. Okay you guys I'm back with a small unboxing from Gucci but before we get into that you know the drill. What time is it? It's housekeeping time. So first, no surprise you guys, I am wearing my Becca Skin Love Foundation and the Weightless Formula in the shade Cafe. And then next you guys, on my eyes today, I am wearing this beautiful palette by Huda Beauty and it's the Khaki Haze. And it looks like that. And I just love Huda Beauty's eyeshadows, you guys. They are so nice and pigmented. But this is Khaki Haze. I'm wearing that today along with another shade I'm going to show you in just a second. But as you can see here, I have this caramel color here in my crease. I have these two colors here, this light brown and this darker shade of brown right here mixed in my outer V area. And then I have this copper looking shade here on my entire lid. And then also on my lid, I have this single shadow that I've had for many years from Gucci. And as you can see, it's in their old packaging. And this color is called Iconic Copper and it's one of my favorite shades. And this is what that beautiful shade looks like. And as you can see, I have used it a lot that the embossing is coming away from it. But you guys, this is such a beautiful copper shade. I absolutely love it. Again, you wouldn't be able to find this because again, this was their first um, line of makeup that they came out with. So the color shade is called Iconic Copper, but I absolutely love that. And then for my blush shade today, I am again wearing by Mario. And this is in the shade Wild Berry. Again, this has been my go-to lately along with my highlighter from Christian Dior. And this one is in the shade Nude Glow. And it looks like that right there. And then as for my lip combo today, I'm wearing this Gucci lipstick here. And it comes in this gorgeous packaging and it's called Call It A Day. And it's such a beautiful nude shade. So it's like that nudie rose shade that I love. Right up my alley. So I have that on my lips along with this deeper Tom Ford lip liner in Extort. And that's what that looks like. The shade is right there. And there you are. Hopefully you can see that shade right there. And then as for my nail polish, same nail polish um, this week. And it's the Tom Ford Black Cherry, which looks like this. And it's a really deep, almost black burgundy shade. So I really, really love this. And my husband gave me a compliment on it yesterday. He was like, I love your nails. So apparently he loves this dark shade on me. So I love it as well. And then as for my fragrance, you guys, this is one when it gets this time of the year, I'm excited because I love the warm fragrances. This one lasts on me so long. It's by Tom Ford, you guys, and it's the Lost Cherry. I can't tell you how much I love this. It is just such a gorgeous fragrance, you guys. It's sweet, but not too sweet. 
it reminds you of like a cherry pie with maybe some liquor added to it with some almonds i mean it just reminds me of baking during the holiday season it it is sweet but it has that warmness to it too so good you guys this is one of my favorite fragrances to wear this time of year and i absolutely love it and then next, as for the jewelry I have on, again, my CC earrings from that Metiers collection, right there. And then as for my bracelet today, I still have on the Louis Vuitton bracelet from that Rainbow collection I've had years ago, but I stumbled upon it, forgot all about it. I remember I used to put this on my handbags too, but I had it in my jewelry um box and i was looking for something one day and came across it and i was like oh i'm gonna take this back out and wear it so there it is you guys it's so beautiful and then as you can see it has the lv dangling right there it has that louis vuitton stamping right there and then all of these are these beautiful gems mixed in pink and brown so yeah you guys that is my bracelet i'm wearing today and then as for what i'm wearing again i just have on one of these shirts from calvin klein this is a nice caramel color shirt i love the color on this and it has a little ruffle around this one so it has ruffle around the neckline and then around the sleeve here and it gathers up here in the front and it's that nice material you guys that feels so soft and good on i love buying these blouses i think i picked this one up at macy's i want to say but i bought a ton of these because they're so so comfortable to wear to work then I have it on with this blazer from Zara. You've seen this before. I've gotten it years ago. And it has the little gold detail buttons on it. And it looks of that like tweed material here. Nice for fall winter. And then I have it on with a pair of black high-waisted slacks from the loft which is one of my favorite stores too especially to purchase like my trousers and things like that because they carry them in petite and i don't have to worry about getting them hemmed somewhere else so yeah love these and then as for the bag i'm rocking today it's that kelly dupe that i showed you before that i had in cream so i mentioned i had it in cream and black so yeah i am rocking this today you guys okay you guys so that does it for housekeeping let's get into this quick unboxing so here it is right here i just opened the lid up it is a true unboxing so there is the small package right there and first I see this beautiful little tote. And I love that Gucci has started to add this with their packaging. I think it is so cute and useful. You can put little things in there. So I have this little tote here and it feels of like a linen type of material. But yeah, absolutely love that. So we have that little tote in there. And then here is the receipt right here. And no worries, I'm going to link it below so you'll have pricing and all that jazz. But let's get straight into this unboxing. And can we just give Gucci a round of applause, you guys, for this beautiful package. OMG, I love their new packaging. This green is so pretty. And just look at that beautiful red ribbon tied on there too. You guys, they are doing it. And they're giving you a little tote as well. They got an A plus for me for packaging. I simply love it. So let's 
without further ado, open this up and talk about this baby. So, ooh, I haven't seen this packaging yet. Your item wrapped like this, you guys. So it has the Gucci like tissue paper here, you guys. So, ooh, that is pretty. So I don't even want to open it. So then inside you get another pouch. How cool is that? So inside is this gorgeous flip pouch here that also says Gucci on it. So if you think you know what this is, comment below what you think this is. But I do have someone to blame for this purchase. So let's get into it. Do you see it right there? You guys, you know I love SLGs. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. So you guys, this is the Ophelia GG key pouch. You guys, I was on the fence about this one. Now, you know I love a SLG. The only thing that was holding me back from it is these trendy Gs right here. You know I'm an old school Gucci fan, so I love these interlocking Gs right here. This, I'm not a fan of here. I can say that. Now, just let me say... I probably would never buy a handbag with these G's on it because they don't remind me of old school Gucci. I love the traditional G's um, with the interlocking ones right there. That's just my style and my preference. And I saw this. That part was, again, the only part that was holding me back, but I love the key pouch. I thought, ooh, that would be great in a handbag because it looks like it fits so much. So I first saw this when Minx for All unboxed it, and then she showed what, like, fits inside of it and everything. And I was like, no, I'm not going to get it because it, you know, had this. Um, G and this only reminds me of like the cover girl makeup. I don't know why it but it does But anyway, so that kind of like turns me off from it, but it's okay now. I, it's growing on me but you guys um, Then I let it go away. I was like, I'm not gonna get it and then my girl Mari snow 77707 unboxed hers and it brought all those feelings back up as as if I needed this so you guys I bit the bullet and I said let me just see what it looks like and you guys I'm glad I did pick it up I do like it and I think it will go nicely in my latest purchase of a Gucci handbag which as you can see I unboxed this one from their travel collection and it has those traditional G's on it. So I thought that would fit very nicely inside of this handbag just to like put my little items in. So I got it, you guys. So here it is. Oh, that zipper sounds really buttery. Here is all the Gucci cards and things like that that comes in there. And also, it has that key ring on it, which is nice. And I really thought with this too, that I take exercise classes in my community. And sometimes when I'm leaving the house, I don't want to have a whole entire purse, not even a crossbody one. I want something like this that I can just put a little money in, maybe a lip gloss or a hand sanitizer, something, some cards, and then clip my key on it. And that's all I need. So that's what made me say, yeah, I need it. But um, yeah, so this is it, how it looks here. So you have the little Gucci plate, nice dark interior that's brown. That is the bottom, the back of it, 
I love this. Now, this is my thing when it comes to Gucci. This reminds me of when I used to buy Gucci back in the day. The signature webbing here, which is the red and green. Love. Um, so, yeah. This seems to hold a lot of stuff. So, I grabbed some items just to see if they'll fit. Um, so, here's my little pill case. Here's the little lipstick I just showed you. Let's see. Here's another one here from Hermes. A little nail clipper here. Some hand cream from L'Occitane. A little tiny one that came in a gift set. And then here I have my little Chanel twist and spray here the little small one from the factory five collection look at that that all fits in there you guys and there it is it's a tight fit but it fits you guys so let's just unbox that and take some things out here and then i'm gonna see if my chanel mirror fits in here and it does look at that so it fits nicely in there. I have a Vaseline lip balm. As my mom says, you always need some Vaseline. That cures all kind of um, dryness. You know, that's my mom's philosophy. And then, let's see. I have two gift cards here. So I have one that I had from my favorite coffee place, Nespresso. And then I have um, Starbucks. So look at that, that fits down in there. So if those were credit cards, you can pop that in there. And so I just took some coins out of my Bastia coin purse here that I have from Hermes. And you can stick some coins down there. I have a dollar here I just grabbed out of my purse. You can certainly fold that down there if you need cash on the go again my pill case some hand cream and there you are with that that fits nicely and closed nicely here and if you can see right here on the zipper pull it still has the plastic on it but it says gucci right there as well but let's open this up you guys it's it carries so much look at all that stuff in there that it has Come on now, a mirror, everything. So this is gonna be my new on the go thing that I take with me just to carry in my hand um, to my exercise class. And then I could just like sit it on the little desk until I'm getting ready to leave. But yeah, you guys, that is what I picked up from Gucci. So I wanted to share that with you. And again, I'm excited because it will look so nicely in this handbag as well you guys really quick this is amazing look how long this is this is one of my favorite lip balms and it's by la mer but sometimes it's so cumbersome to put it in anything because it's thick and then it has this long little glass looking plastic piece here and so it's hard to fit in things but you guys i just try to put it in here and it fits, it fits, look at that, look at that. So I can carry it in here. Exciting. So that is good. But yes, you guys, that is a little small unboxing I wanted to share with you guys today. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much for watching. Again, follow me on Instagram. My Instagram information will be down below in the description. You can just click on it and then follow me there as well. And I am trying to crank out some videos for you this week. So stay tuned. Hopefully I can get another one up tomorrow for you. So yes, you guys. I'm happy about this one. Thanks. So that does it for today. And as always, thank you so, so much for watching. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.